In 2015, college students lived their lives on their phones, capturing virtually every moment. In this case, police say the suspect, an Eastern freshman, recorded himself attacking a fellow student. The young woman told police she left a party and ended up in a dorm room with a fellow freshman. She says he took off her clothes, ignored her pleas to stop, and repeatedly sexually assaulted her. After the attack, she remembered what the suspect's bedding looked like and was able to describe it to police, who already had a person of interest, 18-year-old named Reed Kopeck. The bedding matched. He told police he had sex with the victim and admitted recording it. Now he's facing rape charges, and police are left reminding students again about the dangers they face. And then we have to educate everybody that's involved that this is inappropriate and it's unacceptable. So that part of the, you know, the teachings and, and the training as a society as a whole, we need to get to that point to where, you know, everybody is aware that basically this is this is unacceptable. EWU police also found incriminating texts the suspect sent to his roommate that night. They're waiting for search warrants to find out exactly what was recorded on that phone. Eastern didn't want to comment today about the incident, but the Spokesman Review reports Kopech withdrew from the university and is back home with his parents in Shoreline. They told the judge they are saddened and vowed he will make every court appearance in this case. I'm Melissa Lutt, KXLY4 News.